STS-98 was a 2001 Space Shuttle mission to the International Space Station ISS flown by Space Shuttle Atlantis. It was the first human spaceflight launch of the 21st century. STS-98 delivered to the station the Destiny Laboratory Module. All mission objectives were completed and the shuttle re-entered and landed safely at Edwards Air Force Base on 20 February 2001, after 12 days in space, six of which were spent docked to the ISS. Peru. Topic. Crew notes Mark C. Lee was scheduled to fly as Mission Specialist 1 on his fifth trip to space, but due to undisclosed reasons, he was removed from this flight. His replacement was Robert Kerbeen. Topic. Launch attempts Topic. Mission highlights The crew continued the task of building and enhancing the International Space Station by delivering the U.S. Destiny Laboratory Module. The shuttle spent six days docked to the station while the laboratory was attached and three spacewalks were conducted to complete its assembly. The mission also saw the 100th spacewalk in U.S. spaceflight history. STS-98 occurred while the first station crew was aboard the new space station. Topic: <laughs> Space walks. Topic: Wake up calls. NASA began a tradition of playing music to astronauts during the Gemini program, which was first used to wake up a flight crew during Apollo 15. Each track is specially chosen, often by their families, and usually has a special meaning to an individual member of the crew, or is applicable to their daily activities. Topic. Popular culture and media STS-98 was the designation for the fictional NASA mission to destroy an asteroid in Armageddon 1998 film. Topic. See also International Space Station List of human spaceflights List of International Space Station spacewalks List of Space Shuttle missions List of spacewalks and moonwalks 1965–1999 Outline of Space Science